very first bowl that I went to was the 1951 Orange Bowl in Miami. I was a senior in high school, and my mom and dad and I drove down to Miami to see that game. They didn't want us down there because they didn't know where Clemson was at that time. Now the Orange Bowl itself, where South Carolina's unbeaten Clemson Tigers take the offensive against the mighty Miami. Uh, it was an exciting game, the entire game. Our fullback Fred Cohn makes the first half's only score. Clemson leads 7-0. And he had 13 and up from halftime. Or after Clemson has scored again and leads 13-0, Miami gets moving. Halfback Frank Smith twists his way deep downfield to the Clemson five-yard line. Clemson's lead is cut to a fragile six points as Harry Melios scores for Miami. Another touchdown would give Miami a chance to go ahead. Quarterback Bob Schneidenbox pass to Ed Lutz. They came back and scored one play on a long 75-yard pass play over my good friend Gil Rushton, who I went, went to high school with. And they came back and drove down when he had 14 to 13 with about seven minutes left to play. Now as Jack Hackett throws to Frank Smith for a touchdown, Miami takes a 14 to 13 lead. Late in the fourth quarter, still leading by one point, Miami receives a Clemson punt. Harry Malios twists and turns on a sensational touchdown run that seems to give Miami certain victory. We kicked to Miami and they actually ran another touchdown back that was called back to Clifford. The great run doesn't count because of a penalty. And they have another clipping play. Three straight 15-yard penalties. Back in the end zone. My good friend Don Wade, who was a linebacker, called a gap seven defense. And a gap seven is I just move over one space between a right tackle and their right guard. And the right guard pull. And since he was in the end zone, this Frank Smith, who was running back at the time, couldn't swing deep, he had to swing a little shallower, and I was quick enough to get him right there without being blocked. <laughs> How about that? And I'm famous for one thing. <laughs> Clemson won the game, and everybody knows and about that around here. The last moment safety gives Clemson two points and the game, 15 to 14. It's one of the highlight, true great plays of Clemson uh, football and uh, one that I use as one of my top 10 plays of all time when I'm giving a speech. I can see him right now breaking through that line and tight, tackling the halfback, Frank Smith. It was a great day and a great win, and Sterling was a great player while it was.